Our Father in heaven, we want to thank you, Lord, for this evening. We want to thank you for your enabling grace that has brought us here together. We ask that, Lord, the purpose of our coming here tonight, you will accomplish in our lives in Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord, because you know you've answered. In Jesus' name, we pray. Glory be to God in the highest. Amen. Glory be to God in the highest. Amen. For his mercies endure rest forever. Amen. For his mercies endure rest forever. Amen. Amen. In the highest. Amen. Glory be to God in the highest. Amen. For his mercies endure rest forever. Amen. For his mercy send your red forever. Amen. Amen. In the highest. Amen. Glory be to God in the highest. Amen. For his mercy send your red forever. Amen. For his mercy send your red forever. Amen. Our Father in heaven, we glorify your name. We bow down before thee. We glorify your name. We bow down before thee. Our Father in heaven, we glorify your name. We bow down before thee. We glorify your name, we bow down before our Father, our Father who art in heaven. Amen. Our Father, our Father who art in heaven. Amen. of kings and lord of lords i have a father almighty father he is king of kings and lord of lords i have a father i have a father almighty father he is king of kings and lord of lords i have a father
unto victory. Jesus has conquered. Move on to victory. We are more than conquerors. Jesus has conquered. Move on to victory. Jesus has conquered. Move on to victory. We are more than conquerors. Come believing, come believing. Come to Jesus, look and live. Come believing, come believing. Come to Jesus, look and live. Come believing. Come believing, come to Jesus, look and live come believe in come believe in come to jesus look and live come believe in come believe in come believe in come to jesus look and live come believe in come believe in Expect a miracle when you pray. Expect a miracle when you pray. Expect a miracle when you pray for the Lord. He's seated on the throne. Expect a miracle when you pray. Expect a miracle when you pray for the Lord. He's seated on the throne. Jesus is the answer for our world today. And above him there's no other. Jesus is the way. Jesus is the answer for your words today. And above him there's no other. Jesus is the way. For our word today. And above him there's no other. Jesus is the way. Jesus is the answer for our word today. And above him there's no other. Jesus is the way. Jesus is the answer for our world today. And above him there's no other. Jesus is the way. Jesus is the answer for our world today. And above him there's no other. Jesus is the way. Jesus is the way. Jesus is the answer for our world today. And above him there's no other. Jesus is the way. He has promised he will never fail. I will lean on him. I will lean on him. Our God has promised he will never fail. His faithfulness is forevermore. His faithfulness is forevermore, forevermore. Never fail. I will lean on him. Our God has promised he will never fail. His faithfulness is forevermore. His faithfulness is forevermore. Thy bones shall rise tonight. Thy bones shall rise tonight. Lord Jehovah is able. Thy bones shall rise tonight. Thy bones shall rise tonight. Lord Jehovah is able to do 
one shall rise to night. The sick shall get the healing. The sick shall rise today. Lord Jehovah is able to do all things. He's able, able. Dry bones shall rise tonight. Dry bones shall rise tonight. Lord Jehovah is able to do all things. Dry bones shall rise tonight. Dry bones shall rise tonight. Lord Jehovah is able to do all things. He's able, able. Dry bones shall rise tonight. It shall be permanent. It shall be permanent. What the Lord has done for you, it shall be permanent. It shall be permanent. What the Lord has done for you, it shall be permanent. It shall be permanent. It shall be permanent. What the Lord has done for us, it shall be permanent. It shall be permanent. It shall be permanent. What the Lord has done for you, it shall be permanent. Count your blessings, name the one by one. Count your blessings, see what God has done. Name them one by one, and it will surprise you what the Lord has done. Count it. Count your blessings, see what God has done. Count your blessings, name them one by one, and it will surprise you what the Lord has has gone. Count your blessings, name the one by one. Count your blessings, see what God has done. Count your blessings, name the one by one. And it will surprise you what the Lord has done. Count your blessings, see what God has done. Count your blessings, name them one by one, and it will surprise you what the Lord has running over, running over. My heart is full of running over since the Lord saved me. I'm as happy as can be. My heart is filled and running over, running over. My heart is filled and running over. Since the Lord saved me, I'm as happy as can be. My heart is filled and running over. Running over, running over. My heart is filled and running over. Since the Lord saved me, I'm as happy as can be. My heart is filled and running over. Running over. Since the Lord saved me, my heart is filled and running over. Leave it there, leave it there. 
Take your burdens to the Lord and leave it there. If you trust and never doubt, he will surely bring you out. Take your burdens to the Lord and leave it there, leave it there. Leave it there. Take your burdens to the Lord and leave it there. If you trust and never doubt, he will surely bring you out. Take your burdens to the Lord and leave it there. Leave it there. Leave it there. Leave it there. Take your burdens to the Lord and leave it there. If you trust I never doubt, he will surely bring you out. Take your burdens to the Lord and leave it there. Leave it there. His goodness, His mercy over our life. I also appreciate God your life, your life, your life, your life, your life. And I'm believing God that tonight, the Lord in His power will visit, will reach every one of us in Jesus' name. And uh, I'm believing God that nobody we leave this prayer conference without a testimony and i'm knowing believing god that god will put a testimony in your mouth and also in your family so that by the special grace of god the power of god will touch you and you will have a testimony in jesus name And I hear the response of the people of God. I say, God, we bless every one of you in Jesus' name. Amen. And I also think that uh, the power of God Almighty will work mighty in our life. So please, let us emote ourselves. Okay, emote yourself because tonight I want, I to, want hear to hear people, people pray. And I want to hear people calling upon the name of the Lord. Let us pray together. Our Father, we thank you for this hour. What a great hour. We bless your name for your love over our life. We thank you for your mercy. We thank you for your compassion. We thank you for your love. We thank you for your strength. We thank you for your wisdom. We thank you for your power. We appreciate you. Father, receive all the praises and thanks in Jesus' name. Father, I'm asking that tonight let there be a divine visitation upon every one of us on this platform in Jesus' name. Amen. Every one of us getting connected this prayer conference i pray that the manifestation of your presence the manifestation of your power we crush every strong man we crush every negative thing away from the life of your people even tonight in jesus name amen, amen. the strength to pray the power to pray the spirit of prayer i ask and i pray father release the energy to pray and pour upon us the spirit of prayer as we pray let there be an open door for every one of us tonight in jesus name Amen. give us the wisdom give us the power to prevail to carry as we pray as we carry as we pray the power of god we pull down every strong man and every one of Jericho. 
thank you, Father. Amen. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. I want you to open your mouth to appreciate God and to bless the name of the Lord for all his benefits you are you have received. The Bible says, Praise the Lord, O oh my soul, and all that is within me. So therefore, open your mouth and bless the name of the Lord for his goodness over your life. Bless the name of the Lord for his compassion over your life. Bless the name of the Lord for his loving kindness over your life. Bless the name of the Lord for his goodness and for his mercy surrounding your life. Open your mouth and show appreciation to God. Let's go together now. I want to talk to God and appreciate God for who God is, for his goodness, for his power, for his protection, for his love. Open your mouth and appreciate the King of Kings, Lord of Lords. The ancients of days, the ayah that I am, the rock of ages, the temple God, the unreversible God, the almighty God, and greater than the greatest. Let's open our mouths, let's bless the Lord, and worship the Lord, adore his holy name. Give him the glory due unto him, for our God is a good God. Bless the Lord. Magnify the name of the Lord. Exalt the name of the Lord. The Bible says, Bless the Lord, O oh my soul, and all that is within me. Bless his holy name. I can't hear your voice. Open your mouth. I can't hear your voice. Bless the Lord, oh my soul, Lord that is within me, bless his holy name, bless the Lord, oh my soul, and forget not all his benefits, forget not all his benefits, forget all the iniquity, forget all the diseases. Yeah, what oh, is it? Alive from destruction, he will permit thee with loving kindness and tender mercy. Satisfy the mouth with good things so that your youth is renewed like the eagle. Bless the Lord. Appreciate the Lord. Exalt the Lord. Magnify the Lord. Glorify the Lord. Our God is very good. Our God is Lord and so good to you and your household. What a mighty God we serve. What a powerful God we serve. What a great God we serve. What a great God we serve. Great and mighty and powerful God. No one we can compare with him. Give him the glory, the honor, exalt him, magnify him. Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Tonight, tonight, God will visit you tonight. Amen. Tonight, the power of God will locate you tonight. Amen. And every strong old, and every strong man, and every strong woman, the Lord will cross them out of your life tonight in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. I want Amen. to need some prayer requests now. After the prayer request, then we'll now go and pray against every strong man that is disturbing any 
one in the platform tonight. Mm. The first prayer request I have here, somebody said it was on Sunday. He said I ha he had an accident on Sunday. He posted this request on Monday. He said he, he had an accident on on Sunday. Pl please pray with me that I should be justified. Nothing Man, happened no, 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 no. without uh, happen for spiritual. We are going to pray for this person. We have accident on Sunday. Let's pray that God will justify him. Let's pray that the Lord will frustrate every plan of, of the devil towards his life and towards his family. Let's commit this person to the Lord. That God will justify him. He had an accident just on Sunday. He posted this on Monday. And the power of God we intervene and God will justify this person. Let's pray for him. The accident will not affect his memory, will not affect his body, will not affect his life. The Lord will justify him. And divine protection will be upon this person and his family. Let's pray and call upon the Lord. Let's pray and call upon the Lord. Let's open your mouth and pray. God will justify this person. Jesus name we pray. Amen. Let's still pray for this for this this writer that had accident on Sunday. Let's pray that a quick recovery. God will give this person a quick recovery. Let's commit it to the hands of the Lord. That he will recover very quickly. A quick recovery that God will recover him from every accident, whatever may be the, the, the effect of the accident upon his life. God will take it away by the blood of Jesus. The Lord will give him a quick recovery, he will recover quickly in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name, we pray. In Jesus' name, we pray. Nobody say pray for me that God will show you favor and God will have mercy upon him, upon his family, concerning his business. Let's pray for this person's business. God will pray for him and his family. And God will show him mercy concerning the business he's up into. Let's commit it to the hands of the Lord. We need the favor of God upon his life, the mercy of God. Let's ask God for divine favor upon this person, this writer. He said we should pray for him. God should favor him. We should pray for him for mercy. Let's pray for this person. God will show mercy upon upon him, upon her, and the Lord will ma manifest his power upon in his life. Open your mouth and pray. Let's pray for let's pray for him. I want to hear you pray for him. <laughs> In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Somebody said, I want the Lord to grant me and my family full salvation and fill us with his Holy Spirit. Let's pray for this family, the way full salvation. Let's commit it to the hands of the Lord. And God will grant them full salvation. They need full salvation. And God will feed his family with the Holy Spirit. Jesus' name we pray. Amen. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Somebody said, I want the Lord to grant me wisdom and clear understanding on his will for my project. Let's pray for this writer. I want God to give him wisdom and clear understanding for his will for this project. Let's pray for him that this person God will give him understanding now and wisdom for me, this writer, into the hands of the Lord. On the right side, the hands of the Lord, he will wisdom, he will understanding. And God will grant him wisdom and understanding for his, his will, for his project. That is pray for perfect guidance, instruction for the project as well. We also want us to pray for financial open door for his project and divine 
divine supply for that project. Just pray for you. The way it's financial open door, God should open door for you financially. Let's pray for this writer. The Lord will give him an open door. Let's pray for him. Talk to God in prayer. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. This person say, pray that God will help us to make heaven at last. Let's pray for this person. When God will make them to make heaven, all the family at last they will make heaven. Let's commit them to the hands of the Lord. The Lord will make them to make heaven at last. They will not miss heaven. They will not miss is their request, is their desire, is their prayer point. And God will help them to make heaven. Let's pray that all the holiness they need, God will establish them in holiness and righteousness before Him all the days of their life. Let's talk to God in prayer. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Somebody said that God should draw me closer to himself. To know more about God and meet all my needs. Let's pray for this person. When God will draw him closer to himself, let's pray for him that the power of God will draw him closer. The Spirit of God will draw him closer. Commit sin to the ends of the Lord. Pray and call upon the Lord. Jesus name we pray. Amen. Please, I want you to emote yourself. I want to hear people pray. This prayer meeting, this conference prayer meeting, it's not quiet time. So I want to hear your voice, except you're in the car or you're in the road. But if you are your indoor, you are in your house, please emote yourself and pray. I want you to participate in this prayer. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Somebody said, I want the Lord to set suit him and give him the bone of his bone and the flesh of his flesh. Let's pray for this person. Let's pray for the word of God in marriage. And God to set him, give him the bone of the bone and the flesh of the flesh. Let's pray. We will not make a mistake. We will not marry Jesse Tepe. We will not marry Delilah. The power of God will connect him to the bone of his bone. The power of God is the bone of his bone. The flesh of his flesh. The bone of his flesh. The bone of his flesh. Of a bone, flesh of the flesh, palate is of food in your adult, and the short bones of your bone, the flesh of the flesh, the fair of contact, the widow, and the widow, the father of praise. Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Now, I want us to go into today's target and today's message of prayer. Today, I tell you the message of the Ottoman prayer meeting, the terrible and the strong man. The terrible and the strong man. Last week, if you are on the prayer online, last week, I deal with foundation. Yes. That's the prayer we deal with last week, Thursday. And tonight, we want to deal with the terrible, Mr. Terrible and the strong man. 
I read from the book of Matthew chapter 12, verse 29. Matthew chapter 12, verse 29. Or else, how can one enter into a strong man's house and square his goods, except he forced by the strong man? Hmm. And then, he will square his goods. Jeremiah chapter 15, verse 20 to 21. Do have your Bible to listen to me. And get connected to the alert. Jeremiah chapter 15, verse 20 and 21. And I will make thee, and I will make thee unto these people a first brass wall. And they Amen. shall fight against thee. But they shall not prevail against thee. For Amen. I am with thee to save thee and to deliver thee, says the Lord. Verse 21. And I will deliver you out of the hand of the wicked. And I will redeem thee out of the hand of the terrible. Amen. And I will redeem you out of the hand of Mr. Terrible, the strong Amen. man. Amen. In two verses, we, we have quoted Matthew chapter 12, verse 29, talk about the strong man. We need to bind him and square his goods. Jeremiah chapter 15, verse 20, talk about Mr. Terrible, Mrs. Terrible. And I will redeem you from the hand of the terrible. I am praying for somebody tonight. The strong yeah. man are trying to make you go into, re into reserve. That yeah. strong man, the Lord will crush him out yeah. of your life tonight in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 The Bible says, I have this day set me up over the nation and over the kingdom to root out, to pull down, to destroy, to throw down. To build and to plant. The shrine and the strong man and the strongholds of the strong man in your family. How I pray, I command every stronghold of the strong man in your family. I command the fire of the Holy Ghost to destroy their strongholds. And the Lord will set Amen. free tonight in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. The strong man that stopped your parents and wanting to stop you, I want to prophesy to your life. They shall not succeed in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. The strong man was revealed by Jesus himself. And this is why, as a believer, when a person is under the work, spiritual warfare, of the strong man, you have to be sensitive and be aggressive. Once you begin to notice what I want to mention now, you should notice that the strong man is already in inside. The strong man has already captured you. Number one, when the desire to pray is no longer there, the strong man is already on you. Number two, when you have a low appetite, for prayer, your former prayer strength is gone. The, the strong man is already inside. And I'm telling you this so that you will know how to pray tonight. Number three, that you used to be patient before God. But now, you are always in a hurry. The strong man is already inside. Beloved, beware. Number four. When the, that the power and the grace to fast is gone, you don't have power to fast again. No more grace to pray again. Notice something. The strong man is already surrounding your atmosphere. You know, again, that anytime you want to pray, your mind wanders all over the place. The strong man is in charge of that person. Prayer altar. Get out of that. And tonight, we shall destroy every strong cause, every strong man attached to your life, to your spiritual life, in Jesus' name. It is a terrible thing when a strong man dies, uh, but hand over the fire of your life 
to another strong man. Hey, I am praying for somebody tonight. Any power transferring your fire of your life from covenant to covenant, I command the fire of God to destroy them in Jesus' name. Thank you, God. Amen. Amen. Now, whatever Amen. power answering the life, your life, over to any strong man. How I pray tonight, the Spirit of God will cross them out before your life, and you shall have a deep testimony Amen. tonight in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. And when we are talking, my brother and my sister, we are talking about deep deliverance. You will need to understand that one of the reasons that make deliverance deep is when a strong man is in charge of that situation. If you do not buy and cast out the strong man, enter into his warehouse and take whatever he has taken from you, you will remain where you are. And that is why tonight, whatever the strong man has carried away from your life, from your family tonight, we shall recover it from the warehouse in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. This is what somebody said a story with me i always remember the sister said he had that he wanted to get married this lady he makes seven attempts to get married and all the seven attempts failed the first man was stolen by a boy by the boy uh, best the best friend take over the first man, this is someone to, to get married. That one way. This is another son, another man, the second man. He ended one day when she got home and find a fiancé car around. She was very happy until she got in to find out that a fiancé was having a sexual intercourse with a young, a younger sister. That was how the relationship mm -hmm. ended. This same sister find another man, the third man again to get married to life, life, I'm telling you what, life testimony. She find uh, the third man again, out that was, this man was a drug addict, and that man had to go again. He find another man again, the fourth person he wanted to get married. This man appeared to be a perfect man. He was very nice man. But, she find out later that she had 18 years old daughter who he never told about that ended the relationship. The fifth man was a pastor, and this pastor, the fire in arrow, the man run mad. He lost that pastor. The number six man again, he finally wanted to get married. So, on the day of the engagement, this man stumbled and they rushed into the hospital. He never returned back again. Hey. Hey. The last man, the seventh man, this sister find, he ran away by himself because the day he proposed to this lady, he saw three giants in his room that wow. spoke to, 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 to him in his mother's home that oh. day. You, want to, you made a mistake, you proposed to my wife. I hey. wake up. You run away from his life. My brothers and sisters, these are giants. These giants, they were spirits that came into his room through the wall. They give a serious pity, which finally to now neglect that sister. The seventh, the seventh time, this sister try and say, Why? The strong man. Hold it on to something, refuse to, re to release it. This is not a plain matter, brethren. You must shout this loud and clear. Every strong man at the edge of my promised land, your time is up. I destroy your power out of my life. Hopefully, my 
Mystery for me. The Bible says, and I will make thee unto this people a, a pressing proud, and they shall fight against thee. The strong man will always fight. Mr. Terrible will always fight. And they shall surely fight against thee. But they shall not prevail against thee. For I am with thee to serve thee and to deliver thee, says the Lord. And I will redeem, and I will deliver you out of the hand of the wicked. And I will redeem you out of the hand of the terrible. You are going to pray. Every evil hand that is attacking you. Every evil hand that is oppressing you. Every evil hand that is bringing trouble into your life. Oh God, break the hand of the terrible out of our life. Break the evil hand of the wicked out of our life. And the Lord said, and I will receive you out of the hand. The hand, the hand of the terrible. Every spirit hand in your life. Every spirit hand in your finances. Every spirit hand in your marriage. Every spirit hand in your body. And the Lord said, I will receive you out of the hand. The hand of the terrible. Call upon the Lord. All those evil hand of the person in your life. I'll come to me. All those evil hand of the person in your life. I'll come to me. All those evil hand of the person From the scripture, it's always from the Bible. The Bible says that the rod of the wicked will not rest mm-hmm. upon the loss mm-hmm. of the jaws. Yes, Let the, the righteous put forth their hand into iniquity. You are going to pray. Every rod of the wicked will, will not be my portion. Every rod of the wicked will not be the portion of my household. Every rod of the wicked will not be the portion of my family. Every evil rod of the wicked will not scatter there. Oh, we will not have pray. The rod of the wicked of our future will not be your portion. The rod of the wicked of
praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I can, I can visualize the brother. This brother was not praying. We are praying against warfare prayer, spiritual warfare prayer. He's not praying. So after the prayer, the brother was asking us, why is it that we always disturb Satan? Why is it that we always attack, we always attack his work? The brother was not possessed. But the brother did not mm. understand spiritual warfare. Do you know, my brethren, mm. the fire arrow to that brother? And that brother mm. went into, into evil that he was not able to recover himself again. You think mm. of a brother mm. that he was about 24 years at that time, went into immorality with 65 mm. years old woman. That is a not to give back, mm. to give mm. back to, to, to that brother. Sixty-five years, mm -hmm. and those of you, Mark of God, those days in the prayer line, you can remember what I'm talking about. The brother is among the, among the chorister. He went oh. into evil mm -hmm. with a sixty-five years old man, about twenty-four years brother. When we are praying and we are waiting for, as in the spirit of Jezebel, we are praying those days. He was never praying. He said, "Why are we disturbing all these things? Well, we should pray on other things now." They fire that brother ah. out of the kingdom of darkness. And that is how the brother mm -hmm. up to now. I, I didn't I did not want hear about the brother again. Brethren, you are going mm -hmm. to pray. Mm -hmm. The ah. Bible says that, that the Lord, Lord will, 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 will so put them. It is a righteous thing with God to recompense mm -hmm. tribulation with them that trouble you. Mm -hmm. You are going to pray. Mm -hmm. All those that trouble me, that mm -hmm. trouble my marriage, that trouble my finances, that trouble my life. The Bible mm. says it is a righteous thing with God to recompense tribulation for them that trouble you. You will pray tonight, oh God, those mm. that trouble me, Father, trouble them for their foundation. Remember the GSS of them about two days ago. The GSS, the GSS, that there are people that are wanted to kill the church. The GSS that if the faith of the pain, God will kill them before they kill the church. You are going to pray mm. all those that trouble you, that trouble your finances, your marriage, your spiritual oh. life. They are waiting to commit spiritual suicide. God shall trouble them. The Lord shall trouble them. Mm. Mm. They are right to stay with God. So they are going to bless the population. I am going to blood of Jesus. All those that trouble me, trouble them. Oh, God, I will be given up for that good trouble. The Lord has troubled him. 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 of your environment. The Prince of Persia mm. was a strong horse, a strong man over Everywhere. the age of Daniel bringing the blessing to, to Daniel. He will stood there for 21 days. The strong man. You are going to pray. I am praying for somebody tonight. As we pray, every eating and open strong man contesting for your life, challenging your life. Every strong man challenging your life. You are going to pray. Oh God, contend with them. Oh God, contend with them. 
Oh God, contend with every strong man, contend with me. Call upon the Lord, Lord, we contend with him. Tonight, you must contend with the Lord. Tonight, 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 this strong man in your marriage, you have been praying for your marriage. That man is not straightforward. Pray, let the power of God begin to contend every strong man of evil things opposing your life. Every strong man of evil things opposing you. 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 We will completely begin to continue. We pray. I Pastor Matthew. I have two prayer requests to give. If I call Pastor Matthew, the first one is that you are going to pray against. Every strong man assigned to your breakthrough. And mm. every arrow of the strong man will backfire back to them. Amen. Okay, Amen. Pray. Whatever strong man assigned to your breakthrough, an arrow of the strong man backfire. Fire of the arrow. Fire of the strong man. 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 Fire of the and the PRC is far away in Africa, yes. We are going to pray. Every power and whatever personality that is giving a sister wrong advice, we are going to pray. God will separate them. Amen. God will separate them. I need to beg and say the sister because the pastor, the brother was telling me that one of the pastors over there was telling the brother that you should forget about the sister. You don't, ah. don't, 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 don't mm. think about the sister again and all that. And the same sister again, friends and colleagues, they are talking to their sisters and try to mislead the sisters. And the sister know this brother is the will of God for me. But the sister is not showing interest. People try to talk the sister out of the will of God. We are ah. going to pray that God will separate mm. the sister from all those strangers. All those strangers that have attacked their sister, let's pray God will separate them. The call will separate them. They will be of God. The call 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 will be of God. Let's pray for the brother that this incident will not affect him. But God will encourage him. The Holy Ghost, mm. the Holy Ghost will comfort him. Mm. The Lord will strengthen him. Let's pray for him mm. that the, the Spirit of God will, 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 will comfort mm. him. The Lord will strengthen him. Mm. This time around, after all weakness, the Lord will, the Lord will energize him. The and the Spirit of God will come and strengthen him. The Father will not backslide. The grace of God will come and the grace of God will come and strengthen him. So shall it be in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Pastor Matthew, sorry, it's over to you, sir. Uh, praise the Lord. 
I just wanted to uh, why I'm doing that. I want uh, I don't know maybe uh, the sister maybe the name I want to call is sister or your brother, but I want him to ready. We are in the time of open check now. Uh, we will allow him uh, the person to say whatever he want, and by the December latest. The person will share testimony in Jesus' name. Amen. December, the month Amen. of testimony. And every one of us have been requesting from the Lord. I pray by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. And I remember the family of Pastor Ali now. All what they requested for. By the power and the blood of Jesus, God is going to grant it in Jesus' name. Amen. And the name of the Lord is going to be glorified. Amen. So Amen. I will call on... Uh, Person that is bearing Ola Bamiji from from maybe to request or whatever uh, he wants God to do for him before December. But before then, before then, I want us that we I want especially Pastor Lee and the leaders that we have been having a lot more people on the platform. Please let us be approving them, and then let us uh, everyone first be encouraging people. A lot of prayer requests are on the platform now. Let everyone of us be respond to the prayer request. I pray for them and let them know that God is with them. We, uh, we are the one they have as a family. And by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, we are bringing all those challenges. God is going to honor his name in their life in Jesus' name. So over to you, uh, Ola Bamiji, mm -hmm. maybe uh, it's, sister, sir. Oh, okay. Well done, ma. God bless you, ma. Good job, sir. Yes, sir. So we want you to ask for whatever you want God to do. And uh, our leaders are here. The people of the Lord are there. We are two or three gathered. as presence of the Lord. Almighty God, we honor it in Jesus' name. So we are yeah. listening. I want to break to Navy location. Maritally. Navy areas of my life I want to break through. It has been so disturbing since all this soil. This one coming up, this one coming up, and the thing is just so disturbing. Praise the Lord. Pastor Mike, mm -hmm. do you able to hear what our sister said? Yes, sir. Okay, so please lead us in the prayer, and then Pastor Ali will conclude uh, for us. Lead us in prayer, especially for, uh, as I said, this platform, especially this last stage, all the gifts is allowed as far as biblical and by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, God is going to honor his name in Jesus' name. My dear sister, I want you to know by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, that let's see you see, you will not all see them no more in Jesus' name. Pastor Mark, Amen. 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 Mm -hmm. Pastor Mike? Okay, okay. Let's, let's pray for her. She, we have had a request, and the Bible says that the desire of the righteous shall be granted. It is the mm -hmm. same scripture that says, Ask, and it shall be given unto you. Seek, mm -hmm. and you will find. Knock, and the door shall be opened unto you. We want to pray. Our sister won't break through. We want to pray, break through in all ramification. Break through academically. Mm. Break through maritally. Mm. Break through financially. Break through mm. family wise. Break mm. through. Mm. Let's call it the name of the Lord that God will grant our mm. breakthrough. Open your mouth oh, and call upon I 
You might have properly cut off talking about the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. What that you answer all the prayer in the name of Jesus Christ and the name of the uh, Pastor Mike, you can conclude, sir. Father, in the name of Jesus, Amen. Thank you for Amen. our beloved sister. Amen. We want to give you glory. We want to give you honor. We want to give you adoration. O oh Lord Almighty, we pray, Father, you will look upon our sister from your holy tabernacle. O oh God, I pray, all her desire, all that she desire from you, I pray in the name of Jesus, in the unity of faith, Lord, we pray, let them be granted unto her. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. I am praying and I'm asking by your mighty power. Oh God, the Bible says that you are the Lord that answereth by fire. Oh God, I pray what you did in the time of Elijah, you can do it again. Father, I pray every problem that look like stone. Oh God, every problem that look like water. Oh God, every problem that look like wood. Oh God, every problem that look like water. Oh God, every problem that look like altar. Oh God, every problem, every challenge. Oh God, whether visible or invisible. Oh God, that answered by fire. I pray, Lord, you will visit her by your mighty power that all the problems of God represented in her life, let them be consumed by the fire of the Holy Ghost in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Oh, sister, the Lord will say to you,
in the name of Jesus. Amen. Expressing your testimony in Jesus' name. Let's share the grace of Amen. Amen. the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. 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 Do not forget to continue dropping your prayer request on the platform by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. God will honor his name on our life in Jesus' name. Thank you. We shall meet on Saturday by the grace of the Lord. Thank you. Nice. All right. All right, Pastor, don't uh, pay attention to all those people are asking for prayer requests. If in for calling them, if you need permission, just let me know. If there's any way we can be helping each other with spiritually, God will help us in Jesus' name. Uh, Pastor, Amen. thank you. God bless you, sir. Jesus name. Amen. I want us to bow down our head for prayer. Almighty God, we thank and we bless you because you are King of kings and Lord of lords. Thank you because you have power over all things. Thank you for preserving our lives. Thank you for giving us hope to live. Thank you for the benefit inherited in you. Thank you because you are our Lord, you are our God, and you never give up on anyone. Thank you, Holy Spirit, for giving us the enablement to present ourselves before you this very day. Our dear Lord and Father will pray, your name will be glorified. Amen. And even, and even in today's uh, prayer, you will glorify yourself in our lives in Jesus' name. Amen. Everyone will be blessed. Amen. Everyone will be touched. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Today we want to uh, we want to pray. We want to pray, and like God has been giving us testimony in our, our, our in our prayer session, all of our prayer session, you know, is a special opportunity and special privilege that we come before the Lord from different continents to call the name of Jesus, the one God, and that God has been so splendid, has been so wonderful in our life. And that God that has been doing us good will do you good today in Jesus' name. Amen. We therefore encourage that as you are joining, join and uh, unmute yourself. We therefore encourage that as you are joining, join with the uh, with, 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 with full mind, full concentration. So pray and pray through. 
And I tell you that your victory is permanent. The Lord will open mm -hmm. your spiritual eyes and you will begin to hear and know the intention of God for your life in Jesus' name. Amen. Since I thought you had said amen, then say it louder, amen. 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 Uh, we want to look at Ecclesiastes chapter 10, verse 7. Ecclesiastes chapter 10, verse 7. Your Bible? To the book of Ecclesiastes, chapter 10, verse 7. If you are there, say yes. Amen. Amen. I want, I, I, I'm reading now. I have seen Satan upon horses and princes walking as servants upon the head. I have seen servants upon horses and princes walking as servants upon the head. I, I want to ask you one question from what I just read to you now. Who is supposed to be on the horses? The king. The peace. The peace. God bless you. And who is supposed to be walking? Servants. 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 The Lord bless that, the Lord bless that voice I'm hearing. Amen. A powerful amen for that person. Amen. amen. And you have seen servants upon horses and princes walking as servants upon the head. The number one thing that can cause this unfortunate happening is ignorance. Many people are falling through the power of ignorance. And one of the devices of the devil is ignorance. I tell you that thousands and millions of people are falling through the power, through the devices of ignorance. If people were aware of what is about to be for them, no, they will not fall as they pray. That kind of devices would not have worked on the life of whoever. I, I want you to turn your Bible with me to the book of Galatians chapter, one, chapter 4 verse 1. The book of Galatians chapter 4 verse 1. Galatians chapter 4 verse 1. Amen. 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 The Bible says, Now I say that the earth, as long as he is a child, differs nothing from a servant. God <laughs> is the Lord of all. Look at this power of ignorance. Who will make servants to be riding on horse and, and priests to be, to, be, to be walking as servants? It's the ignorance when you don't know your life, when you don't know your position, when you don't know what God has for you, when you don't know the kind of who you are, when you don't have definition for your life, you don't know where you belong. You want to look at Penina and you want to look at Anna. If you are very familiar with the verse and the scripture, who is, who is the first one there? Yeah. Penina and Anna. Who is the first wife? Penina. Anna. <laughs> Who is the first wife? Anna. 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 God bless you for that. You know, we, we need to be studying the word of God. Anna was the first wife. But now, one way or the other, because the Lord has stopped the womb of Adam. And so, if the reality complex from him, and Anna brought herself down, for Penelope to be exalted.